you know but today i want to focus on the gentlemen and we want to talk about what they want in that woman and to help me have this conversation is none other than uh, eric Omoni, aka and this is his real name i think eric Omoni is his real name not not eric when you know a man a man when you get a status a cabello and a guy you know uh, when we give it, uh, he also goes by the name of Lex Jakaba. Is it Jakaba? Yes. Yeah, Jakaba. How are you doing? I'm very well. So, Jinako, who is your point? I think you have ID in the room. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Does it disturb you every time you see the people about the room on TV? And they're like, I see the man that did the Erika or something. I don't know. Ah, this is the idea in the super bad. Most of the time I prefer using Lex Jakaba so that whatever you can do. Right. But the fish will name you. Okay. Yes. So what I'll do, that's it. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to the Yes. Yes. Good stuff. You guys actually do host a podcast called The Man The Man Talk, right? Yeah. The Man Talk 254. Yeah. This is not the, the, the only as you guys are more than this. Go on that. Okay. Uh, what are you what are you doing? What is this? Go panelist to go na Alan Asama, to go na Father Filippo Mgadizi, Father Orthodox, yeah, yes. the priest, the priest, yeah. Or Kanisa, Orthodox Church. Kanisa. Who be at the event this Sunday? This Sunday. Na na kubunga teaching mo jamo to Sunday. Siku juu eh? Ah, to go na Doctor wa Nairobi Events and it was Charles Ugodo right to go na Abdi Kazungu huyo sana mentor wa program hii ya ku mentor vijana yes convict so what your story all right yeah to go na nani mimi nasahau yo before tuende kwa wao nimesahau yo kazungu yo kana meka ngapi kazungu ndani ya approach 45 hivi kwa 560 sisi tuko na kazungu wetu hapa wao msada i don't think tuna tunajua yet yet hmm i don't think serikali ndio <laughs> 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 <laugh
atuangalia ati tunajaribu kupiga the other gender vita mm-hmm. Kenya iko ni tuangalie shida zinatukula zina sikawa naume solution na way forward hiyo okay. ndio kitu tunadu na pia ukiangalia tu, zile area zote tumetembea ukienda yes. Kawangware ukienda Kerigo ukienda Rescos zile area zote tunaenda once tumongea na maboy tumejua shida ni hii Kenya tunafanya tuna identify wazee kwa ajili Kenya mzee anakuambia utasikiza poa sana iko na maarifa iko na maarifa mm. <coughs> so tuna identify wazee tunawaambia this and this time nyi mtachagua ile siku nyi mtakuwa na meet mayang ama mayang mnabonga na wao tunajaribu kuwa mentative vizuri tuwarudishe mali inafaa okay. so unapata tuna hizo ma wale rende za wazee tuko na karika tuko na wazee wengine wa pale resco so na jita wazee wa kijiji mm-hmm. tuko na wengine ngoro na jita ma boys wao ma boys lakini mm-hmm. ni wazai okay. wanasema ni kitu ina happen alright yeah, so hii mambo ya kulialia yes tu tunajaribu tu ilenge data juu story kwa wale wana watch size yes andika the man talk 254 kwenye youtube eh? subscribe tutumie location after hii show i'm sure utakuwa unapata zawadi yako yeah. tuko na goodies hey. tuko na peana so wadi yes all right mm. i'm already subscribed sijiko maneza unsubscribe but i'm subscribed ni kanda pata zawadi all right so I'd, i'd like to believe that both of you are married right i don't yes. know um, Eric are you married? Yes I am. You, you're sure? Because um, it looks like you're not sure. I'm a hundred percent. Ni kama bibi ajui. Wewe ni bwana yake. Ama uko na mabibi kadhaa? Actually hata naona niko na bibi mmoja. Okay. Yes. But are you against having more than one wife though? Uh, are you okay if you know uh, if your wife wants w- 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 woke up one day na kwambia hey, Eric mi nimechoka kukuwa peke yangu hapa hivi nataka uongeze namba 2 would you hiyo <laughs> time ikifika <laughs> tunaweza discuss what <laughs> ni na jambo ngo ngo hivyo ni juu wife na watch at least for mike mike na jobaka bibi yake wewe na juu umeoa <laughs> now i want the reason i've asked kama you guys are married is because uh, my next question would be and let me start with you uh, mike okay. do you feel like you have understood your wife not completely but you have understood her well enough to say that I, 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 this is not a problem. Uh-huh. Yes. Okay, ni metrai ku understand depending nile story ni kona yo. Uh-huh. <laughs> so, na jo times shida vile zina kama na jaribu kuzi accommodate vile zina kuja. Yeah. Yeah. So, at some point yes, at some point bado 50-50. Right. But tadil to nine. So, in your opinion, yeah. una than me what do women want? That is the question we asked last week. What do women really want? And especially in the context of a relationship. Wana wako wanataka nini? Okay. Eh, hey, you know, you so limekuwa tricky sana. Do what I tukiwa tuna chat now alikuwa ananiambia yenyewe wewe ingia hapo tusikie. But eh eh Mickey ni najua una try ingia as much as possible. Unajua mwanaume ni yule msemwe nye hata kuwa na kushow kila kitu ati tuende na hii barabara. Yes. Mwanaume ni yule msemwe nye Kenya na try ku prove ata prove lakini vile tume brought you up tunajua anga si ni malions, ndio? Yes. Na nikiangalia hivi ile enzi za kitambo ukiangalia kulikuwa ile time nakula kuku kama kuku imechinjwa mtaa ulikuwa unajua imondo ama i gizzard ni mzee hiyo ni mzee yeah. siku hizi unaweza iona kweli mimi ana sifa haifi yangi kwa sahani haya unaangalia hiyo ndio inaanyanga inaanyanga kachu hivi imetosha yeah. kama chakuli imeiva kama kamera iko kametosha hiyo ifikangi kwa meza then unaangalia vitu kama drumstick drumstick ulikuwa unajua anga kama mimi vile najua mm-hmm. hata saa hizi yes drumstick ni uh, kama mini mzo wa nyumba yes. mtu hii afai kula kama niko around okay haya na kama kulikuwa na mz, kama mimi niko yes. na kuna mzee zaidi yangu hako na yeah eh. but sasa hizi hata itachezi watu kitchen so <laughs> mimi actually kwa nyumba yangu drumstick ina kwanga mtu hii mm. yundi iko na nyama mingi mm-hmm. na kale ka, ka, ka breast kana kwanga na nyama mingi yeah. so hizo naona anga tu ikipa kula mtu hii na angalia anga tu ikienda hivi <laughs> mimi nabaki na mifupa <laughs> Yeah. na kitambo ilikuwa migundo zao na yes. kichwa. Yes. So okay, hii Kenya mademo anataka mm. so as much as wanaume si ujaribu kuwapatia but at some point. Yeah. Table zao comes in at 10. Okay. Eh zao comes in at 10. All right. Yeah. All right. Mike, ah uh, sorry, Eric, yourself, what do you think uh, women really want in the context of a relationship? Uh, I think in the context of a relationship there are quite a number of things that mademo anataka. But then unajua as men unajaribu kufika kiwango fulani. Mm. But then uh, I think most of the time they look for honesty. Yes. Wanatafuta anga ile mwanaume akuwe honest na ye. And then tena mademo wapendi ma boys wana wanatembea tembea. Okay. 
ana akiangalia nini yako apate uko na demu mwingine mm. una as in basically mm. apendi uki interact more yes. na the opposite gender madem wengine anaonanga ni kama ni competition okay and then faithfulness it's like uspokuwa faithful wode mamtasikizana naye alright and of course eh, wanaume unajua wenye wanaume u behave unashikwa one time leo unacheza hivi unashikwa tena yeah. una, na saa nyingine hata siati ni kitu serious labda mna chat tu ile ya kuzoyana kulifuata friends kuflat yeah. flat hapa pale yeah. madem wataki kusema yeye ana flat na madem wengine okay anataka nga yeye ndiye kwa the center ya hiyo attention and i agree i agree i, I love that the hard way mm. um mimi nimeshikwa <laughs> isto flani na unanga machali before wakifika home wanamaliza nga phone call kwa gari ndio washuke sababu <laughs> akiingia kwa nyumba hiyo siku hizi kuzo tena mm. whether anaongea na colleagues mm. whether anaongea na magalde wenzake wengine mm-hmm. but phone calls my sms zo maliziwa kwa gari before mtu aingia kwa nyumba mm. now let's get now to the men in 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 your relationship when you are looking for a woman to marry a woman to court what were you looking for exactly and did you find it uh that's uh, that's a tough one because uh, most of the time we sisi wanaume mm. we tend to go for looks features zile ziko kwa mwanamke and uh, we forget character so me personally nilikuwa naangalia of course lazima waangalie looks eh yeah, lazima zikue lazima zikue yeah. ukue na wife mwenye unaweza present mahali wasa waseme hey Lex akona ameweza ameweza yes but then besides that yes looks wasa watakuwa appreciate huko nje maboys watasema hey umeweza but sasa ukienda tu for looks peke yake utarudi kwa nyumba unajua huko maboys watakuwa yeah. ni wewe utakuwa na hand wa peke yako unapambana na hizo looks unapambana sasa na hizo looks yeah. kama character ni tofauti no, no. so <coughs> most of the time sorry i looked for character yes. of course nilianza na looks nione anakapoa anajua ku dress yeah. and then sasa venya na reason mkae na date moja mbili tatu one venya na reason of course kila mtu anapenda do huwezi sema ati natafuta de mapendi do yeah. kama mapendi do nani atakupush when the, the extra exactly. mile ku hustle exactly character and then uh, honesty mm-hmm. utafute de mwenye ako honest mm-hmm. and then utafute de bado mwenye mnaweza interact vizuri naye Okay. Jona jo bado ina kama ni kitu nataka ili to marriage yeah. mtakuwa na watu wengi mm. uko na demu wenye anaweza bado semianaweza kana watu chini wa reason pamoja mnaweza mm. discuss na how to raise your children mnaweza yeah. discuss na finances mm-hmm. how to manage your finances na basically development okay. mm. so uh, yeah. yeah all right uh, mike delisa What about you? Wewe wakati uliko unatafuta wife. Mm-hmm. What are some of the things because I'm, I'm sure what he has said is part of what you are looking for. Mm-hmm. But what else can you add on to what uh Jakababa amesema? Eh hey, mimi na okay unajua time za kukatiana. Mm. You are very sweet. Hapo mtadanganyana vizuri na zikuwa tu tamu sana. But sasa reality hiyo kuja time kwa pamoja. Hiyo ndio ile picha sasa utakuwa na vizuri. Yes ile time na katiana. Mm. <coughs> so Kenya mimi nataka ni sitaki kitu toxic. E, kitu ya pili nilikuwa nataka niweze kula. <laughs> so unataka wife ama dem mwenye anaweza karanga hiyo kitungu po ana hiyo nyama. Chakula zote? Yes. Eh. What's, what's your favorite meal? <laughs> matoke and uh, ya yeah, matoke. Okay. Yeah. All right. So wife anataka kutenda hizo zote. Yeah, anajua anajua. All right. Eh uh-huh. next. E, pia nilikuwa nataka peace peace of mind. Hiyo ndio kitu muhimu sana kwa mwanaume, kitu inaitwa peace. Hiyo tunaweza agree kila mtu. Yes. Yeah. So ni peace, kitu toxic hiyo toa nje kabisa. Hiyo yes. ni red flag. Hiyo mm. tunakimbizana nao mbaya sana. Mm. Mm. Peace of mind inaweza kuwa relevant to a lot of people. Kuna I mean uh, relative sorry that's what I was looking for. Relative to a lot of people. <coughs> Kuna mtu kwake peace of mind ni sana zile bibi hata yuko hapa. Mimi nataka tu nikija kwa nyumba, yeye eh, ajishughulishe huko jikoni na ile swali nataka tu kuulizwa ni umeshiba ni kuongeze tunaenda kulala but kuna mwingine peace of mind anataka bibi yake akuwa hapo wachape story bila kuzushiana mm-hmm. i don't know in your opinion what is peace of mind unajua naume wapendangi kuulizwa maswali mingi siji ulitoka job sangapi ulipitia wapi ulikuwa na nani ni nini uli una get peace of mind ni ile mkuje venye tu umesema yes tukai chini kama ni movie to watch prepare food tukule 
as in to have to some good time to discuss either issues the how am my development but then kama ni job ni ulize job imekuwa aje ni kuambia siku yangu briefly venye venye ilikuwa unajua yeah. maboys waongeange sana and like mtu ka wife yako ukimuuliza job ilikuwa aje unajua atakuanzia asubuhi eh akombe venye wote walisumbura na ye exactly kwanza venye alingia matatu mbili kona mtu alikuwa ananuka jasho hapa yeah. the rest juu alimpita yeah. stage yeah. story yote yeah. manume anaenda ng'a direct to the point yes kwa hiyo nimekuwa poa nimekuwa na meetings kama mbili yeah. Azo ina kamsho mwezi. Zote zilikuwa poa, do ina commandment. So do iki kama tunapanga tutafanya hii na hii na hii. And that's it. And then nataki kuulizwa, okay sasa hii do ikikuja, hii yenye tunafuta unataka tufanye? Eh? Unataka tuifanyaje? Sasa hapo utaona sasa ameanza kulin back na kwa kile yake anajiuliza sasa. Is it detail scene necessary? Yes. Sasa kuambia do ina commandment. Ngoja tu nini? And then If you get and then sasa tupange from hapo and then sasa tena ile piece of mind yenye sana sana wanaume wanataka mm. unajua kuna wanaume wanaingia ng'a home yes unaingizwa na kukorofishwa yes sasa ingine doi imechelewa na hata wife mwenyewe anajua doi imechelewa true and then anaanza sasa kuambia oh sijui nini nilikwambia nini hakuna mm. mbona hujakuja nayo naambia oh, babe si hata unajua sijalipo hata unajua sijalipo eh. akaja ingia nikipata ka kitu eh. actually hiyo tu vita nunua nitakupatia wewe wewe ndio ununue na ukipchange eh yeah. una get so yes. wanaume wapendani kwa official right mm. um he has mentioned something interesting unajua <laughs> wife yako anajua anga unatoka anga job whether ni job biashara whatever mm. she knows that by 5 umefunga job mm. alafu unaingia home then so of course lazima ulize eh hey, babe kwani job ilisha 5 najua awishi mbali i mean natuishi mbali na job kwako at, at most hata traffic ikashikanaje by 6 7 unafaa kuosha ingia home. Hizi mm. ni gani unafika home ten? <laughs> si lazima umsho. Okay. Nilitoka, Jaka baba akanipigia simu, mm. tukaingia pale local, tukakula nyama, mm. tukachapakani bia zetu, stories zikashika, game ya Arsenal ikachezwa, tuka watch kidogo kidogo kuangalia time. Ah. So kwani kwa nini ukutaka kumwambia auweze na kukunywa lazima come home? kuni wenye machoma hamungekula sato mbona amekula leo <laughs> how do you deal with such a situation okay unajua Kenya iko mi, mi ever mi waambia nga mtu kama unataka shida avoid shida eh. sasa mimi nimeingia late mimi ni mwanaume obvious connections zangu na Lexi na wewe Paul inaweza mm. kuwa ni kitu inanijenga mm. na inajenga family yangu so utapata at times wewe umechelewa umeingia home wife atanza kusukuma sukuma unajua zile maswali nyingi wewe umechoka maybe ulikuwa na biashara unajua kesho asubuhi 6 unafaa tupatane na mbuvi eh yeah. kesho saa 5 unafaa tupatane na nani but yes sasa vile anakuja kuleta hiyo story yes si rahisi haya hii asoli yako ya siku mzima wewe unajua pia hasul yenyewe kujangi rahisi lazima kutumia akili mob sana sure. ndio ukujeweke hiyo bread kwa kwa tibu but unapata saa mwingine pia naye umetofikiria huko tena bado atakuongeza zingine huku hiyo ndo mwanaume sana kwa sanga peace. Yeah. Haya utapata mwingine sana ni toxic ile design ya. Hii piece yako na ichafu ile design. Yeah. Anajua vizuri au una do? Yeah. <laughs> Pengine job imekatika. Yes. Haya kesho yake anakuambia wewe ni haja school fee ya mtoi inaitishwa. Yeah. Haya. Utamwambia ni sawa tutaisota ama nenda shule kuongea. But hata mka asubuhi niliona hii kitu ile happen. Akia nani? Msana mka asubuhi anavalisha mtoi vizuri yes. wanaenda wanafika kwa gate baada ya mtoi aingie wanapiga about 5 wanarudi we wanaitisha school fee. <laughs> Shuali. Hiyo si unaona umeruinua mjamaa mpaka asubuhi yeah, yake. Yeah. Na pingine anapiga sababu. Hata siku yote imeharibika. Hiyo siku imeharibika. Mm. So yeye anaenda stress stress. So, eh tseme ibati mbaya. Mm. Jioni inafika. Jamaa anatoka asubuhi zake sana so, jopia na mawazo anapata na mwalimu wa mtoi anamuuliza, "Eh niaje? Kwani leo kuliendaje mtoi wa kuja shule?" Mm. Anamwambia, "Ha? Sasa ndo anapiga hesabu anakumbuka. Basi hapa inaka Mama alifika gate na mtoi ama alifika tu nje ya gate yeah. wakarudi kunichokora akili. Oh, so sasa <laughs> kimtoi alifukuzwa. Ah ah, yeye ndiye aliyemwa kufukuza mtoi. Eh. Yeah. Sasa so, una vitu kama hizo inamaanisha PC yako inakuwa ime spoil kabisa. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, valid points of course. And what you, what he say? Unafikiri kuna dem tu anamwanga tu leo anachafua. <coughs> ah leo lazima kanuke. Do you think kuna madem wanakuanga hivyo? Like ile honestly deep down kwa roho yake ameamua tu leo mimi nataka tu nichafue because tumekuwa because me I usually feel that way baby. Mm. Mm. feeling ni kama madem mnangojeanga tu mume wana tu tuko sawa. Mm. Monday to Friday tumekuwa tu fit. Huyu mm. msa agenda out. Agenda ulevi. Mm. Nimechokora simu yake sijaona madem kwa hiyo simu yake. Mm. 
lakini anaamua tu Friday leo lazima katanuka anatoa tu drama za 1986 mashanga <laughs> shetani mgani <we. laughs> I think hizo ni vitu zina happen especially tuseme ile weekend nyingine ulienda out hiyo nyingine ukaenda alafu sasa hii ya tatu anasema acha unajua ukienda unaacha of course kila kitu iko sawa yeah. saa nyingine hata unamwambia si tuende anakuambia ah niko na few things to do weenda ukirudi tutaonana mm. utapata kila kitu iko sawa kumacha food umebuy kila kitu iko sawa yeah. every single time and then kuna siku moja tu anaamua acha leo niambia naenda out yeah. atajua yeah. unakuja tu hivi hata hujasema yes. labda pia hiyo siku umeamua ah acha ni relax unaanza kuvurugwa mm. natio kuna kuna watu wenye wamefanywa hivyo yes because uh, even as we discuss wasio wakipeana stories zao za kwa nini kwa the month of 254 right kuna wasio wanasema mimi siku moja friday nilikuja tu home after job nimeamua mm. tu ni relax leo tuone movie mm. nikavurugwa kelele 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 unaambiwa vitu zenye hata yeah. hujawahi fanya yeah. as in unachekile kukuprovoke right ile tu kukuprovoke mpaka sasa hata kauli kumeamua sasa ah leo siku anaenda au tunaamua yeah. ah nani uko wapi na kam na kam hata sa, hata saa nyingine hauna ka kitu <laughs> unataka tu uondokee <laughs> <laughs> unajua umesema hivi nikakumbuka kuna time nyingine kitambo sana na dem flani yangu tulikuwa tu tume chill tu kwa hapo nikapigiwa simu on a friday um tuluk nilikuwa nafaa ku have meeting sunday asubuhi na jamaa flani akanipigia kaniambia eh manze kuna venye flight yangu imekuwa pushed naona nikifika Nairobi jioni tunaweza patana 7 usiku mimi nikamwambia sawa Seven usiku hata sina kitu ya maana nilikuwa nafanya tunaweza patana. Venye nilikana tu hiyo simu hivi. Dema kaniangalia, "Oh, so mimi simu tu maana? Sasa mimi simu." Nikamwambia, <laughs> "Baby, situnishi hapa na wewe. <laughs> Tunaishi nyumba moja, tuna lakisha na maji moja 24/7. Hii ni biz nimepigiwa, hii ni don enda kutafuta. Sasa unaanza kuniambia wewe simu tu maana aje. Mm. Hey, I feel like sometimes you may just this. I don't know what, what's your thought. Mimi naona gani kama wanakuwa na season. Kuna <laughs> kwa season tu ka kuchoma kuna kwa season tu ka kuchoma hadi ile mtu tu ana breathe tu fire unashindwa hey ni aje alafu inakujanga hii times juu kausha i notice pia wewe una mawazo zako unataka tu ile ku relax sasa hiyo siku ndio sasa shetani anaamua kuja na makazini zake na majirani family yote yani issue ina create you out of nothing yani hata ukikaa hivi chini u relax muuliza okay ile time ulikuwa na cause juu eh ana reason ana ana completely so mimi naona nikawa nakuwa na ka season hiyo sijui but naona nikawa kuna ka season 2 fulani yeah. apart from ile kuona mwezi kuna time fulani zinaela yeah. but kuna ka season 2 kwa ukam yes hata mm. ka season ka kuona mwezi nataka tukaongelele because <laughs> madem ma ujitetea sana na historia pms hiyo premenstrual syndromes mm. postment in kama size ile dema tisa sasa juu kwa sasa eh, ni, ni, ni time yake ya period sasa atuwezi kupumua kwa nyumba mm. ana breath fire it's like you're walking on eggshells Eh yeah? na pia anasikia wakiwa na mimba pia hizo dramas na kuanga mimi sikumbuki mm. venye fianga alikuanga na mimba venye alikuwa na behave but zina kuanga tu I, I, I would like to understand Abu do we have any women out there texting us <laughs> <laughs> Nataka kusikia kama kuna wanawake wote wanatuambia what what the hell is wrong So we are taking a short break when we return <laughs> Ningependa kusikia na in case kuna tumetuma makombora hizo uh, hizo ukate <laughs> But don't go too far guys we'll be right back a very good morning to you and welcome back to KB Force this morning. My name is Mugala Mugu, it's Relationship Thursday and this is a direct appeal to the National Police Service, we need security. And before we put on the first text, what are you going to say to my co-host Chico Ka Intani? Good morning. Chico and Asema just see me haters. And by us, she means the good in this uh, studio right now. And Asema, at peace, na mimi ni kifika home late, am I not wife material? And for your information, you want us to understand when bills have not been paid will i walk into quick match and tell them uh, that the kids need milk akinini hey shiko shiko ene nyumbani ni unafanya kazi yako imeisha mshahara wako imeisha enda home who do we have ajenda wapi abu shiko enda quick match na kwa njia mazima na lima i who do we have there eh the money will be at the team first of all a man should be exactly what he wants in a woman you will never get what you are not. If you want a God fearing woman, you must be fast a God fearing man. Bubi, let me tell you one thing. A man who submits to the heavenly authority will automatically get a submissive woman. So a man should have uh, should have the traits that sorry guarantee him before God that uh, then that's exactly what he will look for. A man also looks for stability in life when choosing a partner. 
if you want peace from a woman, be at peace with yourself first. As a man, I like your program movie. Uh, some problems that men face in, in relationship come as a result of dishonesty and lack of transparency in their lives. Some men cannot account for what they earn, and besides, his face has never seen the sun. So, these good qualities must come from us first as men. No shortcuts. Ah, Odiabo. Thanks, Odiabo. Thank you very much. Okay, hey, I think you can talk about it. I'll say, Musa Bala is there. We'll be here bullet points. Okay, so uh, I think you guys have seen what, what uh, Odiabo has said. God fearing, if you want something in a woman, you must also, you know, um, have it yourself. So, come on, I can be able to get money on them, for example. Here we have to get money on them. If you have a baby, you can't get a baby. You can't get a baby. A mother is not the last one from this baby. And I'm a baby. 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 Ukijua nani wife yako yeye yeah, yako hivi amtazumbua na kwa ajili hapo utakomcha mu accept but sasa ukija kujua later inakuja inaeleza hizo conflict sasa relationship conflicts zinaanza yes. hapo sasa yes. GBV inaingilia hapo actually mm-hmm. yeah mtu anaanza kungara wife yake mm-hmm. all right um mengine <coughs> ya kutolipa bills mm-hmm. um i don't think madam wengi will understand how difficult it is mm-hmm. to make money especially for those ones who do not make number one as much money wacha kuna mse or other kuna dem akona mwanume mwenye ana making over 100,000 shillings mm-hmm. in terms of salary mm-hmm. and maybe her as a woman she probably makes about 20k depending on whatever she's doing mm-hmm. so yeye anajuanga tu mshoo mwezi ikifika mm-hmm. bwana yangu akona 200,000 shillings mm-hmm. kwa account yake mm-hmm. what they do not know is that ika ipesi kona kazi mm-hmm. so ile siku anakuambia babe nataka thao mbili ya nywele una mshoo sina mm-hmm. anaanza kusema aje na ulitengeneza 200 tao <laughs> by fifth na jo msharaka na kwangu imeingia mm. and this one I'm addressing now women like Shiko <coughs> who think that now that ni tarehe 5 
kila kitu lazima ingiane venye nafaa kuingiana what, mm. what's your thought on, on that particular process kuna times of course kuna times vitu zitaingiana venye unataka depending na zile projects zenye uko nazo but the fact that at the end of the month unajua ni kuna certain amount of money doesn't haikupatii uh, ile ruhusa ya sasa kutaka kuichukua yote una get because uh, as much as because uh, it naongelelea salary si ndio yes. uko na 8 to 5 job mm. yenye yako shui na kuingizia hii yes apart from that saa ingine kuna side hustles zimekuwa una need kuifund na some of these amount ndio mm. later on yes. ingine ikuja mwangu unajua saa madem wengi watakangi kuelewa hivi una get and then saa ingine umegetido mm umetumia kaa yote kufanya side hustle mm-hmm. unangoje side hustle ile tech kitu ndio ulipe bills yeah. pengine school fees ziko pending rent rent mm. electricity uko na loan una service uko na loan una service mm. but then again the other point yenye naweza sema ni saa nyingine wanaume si ujiingiza kwa ishida yeah. some of these things inafa uko unamwambia si ati umu, na pia sisemi atumwambie saa kila kitu yeah. unajua wanaume kuna so, vitu zingine wanapenda lakini si kila kitu kuna wanaume kuna vitu zingine wanapenda kujiwekea especially kama it's a, it's a new project na bado uko 50-50 about it mm. ujui kama itaingiza ama itaingiza mm. so una investi pesa unamwambia kuna pesa nime weka mahali mm. na ngoja ivane vizuri ndio mm. nimalize some of this shida ya madema wajuangi hiyo pesa ina, ina hata kwambia ni kitu gani unaweka unafanya <coughs> because in her mind like again i said let's let's actually let's just break down 200,000 mm. for this woman mm-hmm. so dema anajua ukishamaliza kulipa kila kitu unajua kama deni za hii nyumba yote yes. zita cost maybe 150k mm. so anajua pale kwa account kuna 50k imebaki mm ndio mm. so yeye anajua ushalipa nyumba ushalipa rent ushalipa loan ushalipa nini 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 mm-hmm. so anajua kuna 50k imebaki na maybe wewe kwa akili yako 30k imeenda savings 20k ni yako tu ya kujibamba mm. emergency madem ni kama hajuangi pia sisi tunafaa kupumua mm. dema tu anaumengara watch mpya ehe so live watch mpya baka you like lakini <laughs> i worked hard i need to wear a new watch <laughs> eh yeah. umekamna kiatu mpya home okay so umenua kiatu mpya ume ni bayarini mpaka you like okay sasa nisifanye hizi vitu i don't know mike what do you think mimi naona nga unaona hivyo unasema kiatu mpya eh unaweza kunga sasa tusifanye kiatu mpya ati unajua tunaona yeye amepiga hesabu yake anaona ah wewe umevaa kiatu mpya maybe saa mpya mm. ajui pia wewe yenyewe unafaa kuwa na luku ndio mm. at least uweze ku convince watu wengine ama job yako aende vizuri exactly so yatakuja hiyo story yanza ngi at direct mm. inanzi anga tu na huko unajua hata mimi nafaa anga ni kwenda na dunga mm. na siku hizi naona tu na anga tu shopping yako peke yako yeah. actually in short demand za madem sa zine zinakuanga yani ziko tu juu ziko tu wewe wewe juu sana sana ile ukizifikiria unaona hapana hii na ni pin yeah. eh kwa ajili yako na vile unaweza niambia mimi nakula mshahara maybe ya 10000. Mm. I won't take a shopping ya 20000. Unataka sijui yani una exaggerate tu vitu yani tu sana. Eh. Ni tukwe tu realistic. Ukijua ni vile tu ama ni vile tusema ngi mshahara yetu. Eh. Maybe <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe ni vile tusemi mshahara. Yeah. But pia unajua pia hakuna mwanaume anaweza ataka worth yake ende down. Yes. So lazima tu protect pia side zote. Mm. But naona Attend hizo mavitu zenye hata shiko anasema yes. ziko tu realistic. Hakuna vile unaniambia tuna afford hapa kata kata za mtaani. Ni hata akimbia kuchukua kuku ya KFC zile na huko. Kidogo itakuwa ngumu. Itakuwa ni ngumu. But you know I know of, of men who actually do that. Mm. Chali anamaliza hasuli yake anapitia kama ni hiyo KFC ana dishi. Mm. Alafu sasa anaenda home. Na hata sema alikuwa wapi? Hata sema amekula KFC. Hata akiuliza anasema hata sema ah nimekula pale kwa kibanda madondo chapo. <laughs> But yeye yeah, anajua tu. <laughs> Nikisema nilikuwa KFC. Kwa sababu hiyo ya KFC venye alimaliza tu hivi hivi dustbin. Hata hizi nitaka yani hata hizi nitaka kununuka kaa KFC. Habari ache koti kwa kwa, kwa gari aende akakuli. Cuz cuz sometimes I think it's like women will not understand that 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 perspective that I also am an individual who needs to live my own individual life. Mm-hmm. Eh kuna ma time tu mimi tu niko kivi yangu pia nataka tu kungara kiatu yangu fiti nataka ningare tisho yangu tu smart. Eh na naweza kwa nimejibaia juu hiyo doi litosha tu t-shirt moja mm. but next time pesa kitosha ndabai tisho ngapi tisho mbili na i think tena kuna sijui kama ni kweli though but i think kuna madem wanajuanga uchali ni kikana eh sorry chento hii ndio nione vizuri eh yeah. naona eh yeah. madem wanajuanga uchali ni kikana eh yeah. uwezo wake inafikia hapa yes but then when you look at nasema kuna season anataka tu yani kuburuki atakupush yani beyond 
ile limit yenye wewe unaweza mm. mpaka uone like uh, did i really make the right choice True. but then in the long run tena nakuja na kuelewa na kuambia unajua kulienda hivi kukakuwa hivi nilikuwa nataka hivi na hivi mm. na nilikuwa naona ni kama uweki effort but as I know umejaribu kuweka effort tuko poa yeah. una get so i think kama unajua limit as much as utajaribu kupush mm. kuna mahali chalia kifika ukimpush zaidi yeah. sasa ta, atarudi Daribu. sasa a relax yeah. alikwambia okay sasa unataka hivyo mimi sina yeah. nataka nifanye nini sasa tukae tu sasa acha tukae tu mm. sasa tuchome kila kitu sasa tuchome kila kitu sasa mm. though anajua as much as namwambia hivi kuna mahali nafaa hata kama ni kwa just kidogo mm. ni jaribu kwa just but then sasa unajua ume mpush problem majaribu kumpush in a negative way yes. yenye si at nile constructive discussion right ni wewe unataka uonge uonge umalize kuongea na chali unajua okay. kuna point nafika anga chali ukianza kuongea ifike point yenye sasa nafikiria umeanza kumgombeza mimi mm. nitanyamaza ana withdraw eh yeah. bro safi eh yeah. let's take a look at some of the feedback uh, coming from uh, the viewers in case you're joining us we are talking about what men want in a woman uh, some of that we said hatutaki mademo akelele nyingi Hey, I don't think kuna mtana pendanga kelele hata majema mpendi kelele. All right. So who do we have? Hey movie, I have a question. I have a baby daddy. We were good at first, but once nilipata, he didn't want to take me to Hosi. I had complications and every time I was being told niende scan, but yeye yeah, alikuwa anakata and he never supported me. Hakunisaidia ku buy anything ya mtoi. Now that the baby is here and cute, healthy and everything, he wants me nisahau the past. Then you say women are bad. No, I didn't say women are bad. I didn't say women are bad. Usini crucify. Eh. Esmiliano anasema, um, it's not a season at all. You men sometimes suck for real. <laughs> I say don't do this or that. Then after two days, mwanaume ni nani? Unafanya. Then first day, second, six, nimenyamaza. Then nafika mwisho, then unafanya tena. Makosa ati ukisema, "Oh, uko base ndio huyu mimi na kam and we have not solved the issue men always run away they don't solve issues okay all right all right yes million of like kuja tu size here ku solve issues and i'll explain to you how men usually have an issue about solving issues who do we have women want to control men ukweli this is a mask model this is your friend Mr. Mendika message eh? women still have a conversation with the serpent just like the, the mother Eve and when they have that conversation men will not know peace men deal, deal uh, with a lot of demons before they get home for them to be the pillars at home uh, if he brings his demons home shida tupu hapo good conversation a man will always pay the basic bills by any means necessary however the basic bills must not be what the women deem basic okay all right Esmiliano hapa amesema it's like we we kuna jamaa kwanza amesema we don't deal with issues we don't like talking about our issues uh, and me i feel like sasa zingine mademo choose the worst time ya ku deal na issues ana choose ku deal na issues za leo umelewa mimi mm. najua wanaume wakilewa ni ngumu sana ku tuelewane juu ya anything sometimes you kubali your story ishe because nataka kulala ama na, ni nataka kutapika so kwa hapo unaniambia oh <laughs> sijui kweli kweli unajaribu kuniambia kitu important unataka tuende maybe trip Zanzibar mm. mimi niko maji of course nitakudanganya mm. mbebe tutaenda kwanza hebu angalia bonfire wanalibisha ngapi sasa tutaenda kesho asubuhi nitamka reality ni hit hatuna do hatuwezi ende hiyo trip uliko nataka mm. so it, it is good you choose when to talk about issues Usitafute sele chali yako amekasirika ndio mnataka kuongea juu ya story. Mm. Sele amechoka mnataka kuongea juu ya story. Sele ako na stress, hiyo ndio mnataka aita happen. I don't know make you know what you think. Hapo ah, atanichangia vizuri vile umesema. Time ya ku address hizi issue pia ni muhimu. Mm. Na pia unapatanga nyinyi maybe mlikosa na jana. Yeah. But wewe amtaki kuiongelea yani ni zile za ah baby sorry. Lakini amkuenda amku yani amku inini kabisa mwingie ndani mreconcile yani vile inafaa hapo yeah. itakuja inapai unajua kuna ile data collection ma demo anga wanachukua yes. so ataka hiyo data mtaka kaa siku nyingine tena utarudia the same utasikia na unakumbuka siku ile mpaka date mpaka time na pengine ni kitu 1963 mm. unakuja kuambiwa 2023 hakuna venye hata unakumbuka hiyo story hakuna but hiyo yeah. data iko kwa ajili mm. ya nini 
am kui sort yeah yeah make sure mna create two time mkai chini muongee mone basic ya story ilianzia wapi ilikuja mkuje solution mpaka mkuje na way forward ni yeah. sirudiwe tena mm. eh yeah. hapo na hapo na agree but unaja pia okay unaja mm. nitegemea pia kama ni issue for example mliko sana na wife sunday usiku mm-hmm. na mkalala asubuhi kama mko vesi dunenda job mtukaa mimi utokanga home 5 hakuna venye tutaongea 5 am hiyo nani uongo mm. Nitape hasodi yangu nirudi nyumbani 6 nime choka hakuna venye hasodi ndeongelelea sasa hizo and then unfortunately my entire week is like that bros by the time tunaongea jo kitu maybe ni next sato ama next sato but sasa dema nasema eh sasa nataka kuongea je kitu eh umeshinda ngapa tu kaja kwa nini kazi kazi ore kuongea but ni kweli nimekuwa kazi i think i think you know the main reason why wanaume wapendi ku kuji kuji explain Unaje kuneza unaweza una kitu ni wrong mm. useme ah wacha ni overlook wacha is slide but then kwa akili yako uko like uh, mbona hii kitu ina happen hivi and then wanaume wapendi watu wenye wanawadanganya even the simplest lie wanaume yes ataweka kwa akili yes kuna issue ina farm sort but then venye tu umesema schedule yako iko so tight au yeah. hiyo time enough time yenye mkae muonge kuna time unataka tu ufike home mrest to take issues yeah. utaki discussion but then una check you una makosa mm ume ume carry forward ume carry forward mpaka kafika time unasema ah umsinikata ikuiongea nikata ikuiongea ama wewe mwanaume unaona ah wacha wacha slide eh but wacha yeah. ipite hivyo na unajua uja solve yes hakuna mm. hakuna solution umepata so the next time ina happen yeah i love ina happen labda hujalewa sana umekunywa tu kidogo ile ya kukuchangamsha mm. una blow up yeah unakuwa like last time ulifanya hivi uliona si kuongea tena yeah. umeona urudie yeah. but then sijui kama wanawake wewe leo wanga hii story. Sengine, <laughs> sengine Dema amefanya makosa na amejua amefanya makosa. Yes. Ameona umeinyamazia. Eh. And then wewe jaribu kufanya the same mistake. Table is kitan. Eh. It could be something else. Na niko sure kuna wanaume wengi kwa hizi relationships wako wako same design. Yeah. Unafanya makosa, makosa una carry forward unasema ah wacha hiyo iende. Si sasa tuko sawa. Eh. But then the same thing in audio. And then uko like Uh, sasa tunaweza iongea. Sasa leo mnaanza kuiongea unaambiwa si pia wewe ule. Yeah. <laughs> sasa una realize hapa tu ni vita. Wase, we unfortunately have come to the end of the show. Um, probably we shall have a part 2. Uh, Mungu akijalia. Maybe you can just remind guys where to find you again. Mesema man talk to 54 mko mko YouTube. Yeah, YouTube. Do you have a page on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, WhatsApp, Snapchat. Yeah. Wewe ingia tu kwa all social media handles andika the man talk to 54. Hizo stories zote tutakuwa nazipata pale. Kuna story more sana by that konazo mm. unaweza catch up lakini kumbuka tulisema ukisubscribe tu ma location yako upata zawadi all social media handles the man talk 254 the man talk 254 eh tumeingia cbc 254 <laughs> thank you guys uh, and that is why we come to the end as far as our conversation is concerned usijali kama umetuma text na tujeza kuisoma hizi vitu zinakuanga nyingi tena sana i'm sure zezi isha Definitely the conversation will go on on their page uh, that is the Mantok 254 if you want to join them as far as that conversation is concerned I'm just let them know your location and they shall see how to address that particular issue as for now nasema kwa heri tukata next show friday si mnajua venye sifanya ngapa hivi na kuanga tu ni bashment dj tunakuanga na wasanii great conversations as well see you <laughs>